Welcome back to AutoMag's new. Today we will review the off-road car of the future, namely the 2025 Jeep Wrangler. How tough is this car? Let's see the explanation. There isn't a vehicle more recognizable than the Jeep Wrangler. The Wrangler has maintained its robust good looks and useful features throughout the years, and it's easier to operate than ever before with the help of contemporary in-car technology. The Wrangler can be customized to suit any adventure with its two body types, numerous powertrains, including a plug-in hybrid, and plenty of accessible extras. Despite the fact that Jeep is probably not going to change the Wrangler for 2025, the 4XE plug-in hybrid Wrangler is supposedly getting an upgrade. Our best guess is that it might indicate a longer all-electric range, but we can't be sure just yet. Since, like, forever, the Wrangler has been the standard for off-road fans, and the current generation is more than happy to continue that legacy. Wrangler offers an unexpected degree of off-road capability even in its more basic trim levels. When you upgrade to stronger axles, upgraded shocks, and locking differentials, you get powerful, tried and true gear. The classic Jeep has been fine-tuned over the years to make it even easier to drive off-road, with improvements made to features like the low and narrow bonnet and the location of interior controls. There is only ever going to be one Jeep, but the Bronco from Ford makes a respectable substitute. The most formidable rival to the Wrangler is the Bronco, which is just as durable, more suited to driving on pavement, and offers a decent assortment of trim levels and customization choices for customers. In terms of off-road performance, the most costly off-road kits make the Toyota 4Runner almost identical to the Jeep, providing you with a non-detachable top over your head. The 2025 Jeep Wrangler isn't going to get much of a facelift, but the 4XE plug-in hybrid model may get an upgrade according to the speculations. There are a lot of possible interpretations here, but one is that it indicates a bigger battery with improved all-electric range, 